House of Representatives have advocated capital punishment for teachers of FCT School for the Blind, Jabi, for the rape of blind students under their care. They condemned the act while also calling on the police to carry out a thorough and proactive investigation into the incident. Sandra Guana again has the report. The House took the position following the motion on urgent public importance by Honorable Honor Blessing representing Otupo Ohimni Federal Constituency of Bendre State. The lawmaker expressed shock at the ugly incident at the Federal Capital Territory School for the Blind Jabi, where blind students were molested and raped by their teachers. The school were shocked at the revelations made by the students and teachers over a blind teacher and one other visually impaired who regularly raped and assaulted girls at the school. Concerned that a teacher in the school, one Mr. Ibineza Olatuji, has since become infamous for leading the blind students into hotel rooms where he drugged them to sleep before raping them. Aware that the school authority had confirmed six reported cases of rape by this Mr. Ibineza. Also aware that the, another blind teacher, Mr. Ilo Chukuma, was found to be notorious in fiddling with the breast and other sensitive parts of the blind girl's body. She called for drastic steps against the offenders to serve as deterrent to others and would be offenders. I urge the House to condemn in strong terms the rape of blind underage female students by their teachers at the FCT School of the Blind Jabi. Urge the relevant department of the Nigerian police to carry out a thorough and proactive investigation into this matter. I also urge the House to take a firm position in support of capital punishment for perpetrators of rape and violence against underage girls. Urge the House to set up a committee to investigate the matter, make appropriate recommendations and report back to the House. I so submit. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. The motion was adopted by a unanimous vote by members who called on capital punishment for the offenders after a thorough investigation by the police. So, except if we are going to avoid the petition. Amendment? Sandra Guan, TVN News.